<sighs> All right, change of scene. We are back in the UK. Just literally got back from Andorra. I pulled a quick change of gear setup from a mouse testing trip to my next kiteboarding trip. Guess where I'm off to? I'm pretty sure this bag is heavier than 32 kilos. Oh shit, where's the lift? I used to stay a fool, but now I sniff you. Hey guys, we are here in Burgas. This is the main kite spot here. Comment below, subscribe to the channel, get involved, and thanks for watching. Never thought about Bulgaria for a kiteboarding trip. Boom, and just like that, we are off to Bulgaria. As you know nothing about it, I better do some Googleizing. <laughs> Meeting with the airport director here, straight off the plane. Woke up in Bulgaria this morning. Wow, look at this spot. Apparently, the whole place is a National Heritage UNESCO site because it's over three and a half thousand years old. This town is only a square kilometer and it's on a small headland, almost like an island, but just packed with ancient religious architecture, churches, tiny little buildings, and amazing places like this. Not a bad place to start the day. Morning one, it's given me a pen as if I'm gonna have to sign some things here. I'm reliably informed that it doesn't matter too much if there's wind or not in Bulgaria, there's always something fun to do. Beach. It's windy. He's making it look windy at least. And uh, looks like we're gonna get a little foil session. Flew all the way to Bulgaria without a kite leash. Aha. Uh -huh. Perfect. I think it was a really bad idea to let them know that it was my birthday on this trip. No way! It looks mostly like rakia, which is the local beverage. No, <laughs> Not that strong. Turns out I was completely lost. I have no idea where I am. Anyway, this is Tourism with Tom Court. I'm caught in the act, so make sure you subscribe to my channel and you will not know where I am, what the film doing at any point.
And we're here again <laughs> at the beach in Bulgaria. And there's no wind. So cheers. Okay, guys, we are here in Burgas. This is the main kite spot here. The whole kite center is operated by Surf Shop Burgas. This is it, Surf Shop Burgas, the shop right here. What's up, bud? How are you? That was Surf Shop Burgas, private tour, pretty dope spot and everybody's just turned up to the event. We are on the beach, everyone's set up, and uh, we're waiting for the wind. Fun event yesterday, not much wind, but today Rado is going to show me some of the sights of Bulgaria. And a lot of churches in Nesebara. <laughs> and a lot of churches. Apparently there's 40 churches in a town one square kilometre in size. Some of the churches are functioning and some of them are just really, really old. The ones that are functioning, you're not actually allowed to use a camera in, but check out this bad boy. Cameras permitted only for customers. Ooh. Okay, now this smells like an old building. Just uh Cheers bro. He's on the hat too. On the top, here? Yeah, yeah, on the top. Here you go, here. Yeah! <laughs> Another present! <laughs> Put up a new flag, look! Boys! Well, that's that then. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You're professional. Yeah, mate. It's the case. <laughs> this could be like me swimming. Well, 
fucking swamp. Oh my god. Never will. That's a lot. I hope they sent some hedgehogs down here to eat all the snakes because it's filled like snake land. This is one of those moments where you wonder why the f you got out of the car. Ah. This is this is kite surfing for you. <laughs> okay, you gotta all believe believe that the session will happen. This feeling a lot better right now. Doesn't get too much flatter than this. Anyway. Really. 